Were you like you, there's a scene in the in the show where you you had community service and you had to kind of clean walls as part of the community service and the paparazzi is literally five feet away taking just pictures, snapping photos. Is yeah. that irritating or is that like kind of that kind of comes with the territory? It's I'm I've been doing this for 15 years, so it's been a very long time. You just get used to it. But the community service, she didn't take it seriously, Jimmy. She was goofing around. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't. I think people are gonna be very sensors. mad <laughs> I like that she wasn't painting the wall properly. <laughs> Even community <laughs> service, you like that with a little. Well, bit she of brought fun. another person. Yeah. I just want to show her that I saw the show. She brought her assistant, yeah. so it was two people working on the wall that day. So she's thinking maybe she should get the uh, double time. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good idea, right? What was the uh, community service for? Um, I just have to do some for a little thing. A little thing. Yeah. There's a little. Uh, Possible mishap. Jesus, <laughs> really? Your assistant, by the way. You're out of your mind. You're a little, you're a little too wild, I think. No, not anymore. Not I'm anymore? Not Have you? I'm so busy. I run a huge brand. I have 17 different product lines. I'm constantly traveling the world, working. So, um, yeah, I'm way too busy. No much, uh, no more time for like complete shenanigans, or no. Do you see other celebrities like uh, Lindsay and go like, oh boy, what she's going through, like? Want to smack her in the face or something? No, I wish her the best. But, you know. Yeah, but there's got to be something in you that goes like, okay, I've been there, I've seen what 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 where that leads. Um, and I just wish her the best. You know, she's going through a lot, and I thank God that I have such an incredible family behind me. A lot of times, celebrities get away with more, and it, it almost like it kind of sets you up for when. When they fall. <laughs> What's like, that about? <laughs> Nothing. I just want to come here to talk about the show. I don't really want to talk about Lindsay and things like that. You know, oh, that well, was just time. <laughs> just well, no, I was talking I, about like I was you actually. Know, I was, I'll, I'll tell you. Attributing it to you though. I was actually kinda... talking about you. I was saying. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I saw the look. Yeah, but the question was: <laughs> get celebrities get away with more. Does it make it harder because without certain things stopping you along the way, when you finally do get in trouble, it's big. So that's kind of what I was. Yeah getting it. All right, let's move on. <laughs> okay, tell us all about the show. I guess we'll just talk about the show. The World According to Paris is amazing, and it's on every Wednesday on Oxygen at 10 p.m. And um, Are you annoyed? I'm excited. You sound annoyed now. It's very early in the morning. I'm tired. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she sounds oh no. I've been, I know I've been on a press tour all week. <laughs> you know, uh, we, didn't, a we didn't want to annoy you. <laughs> I'm a little annoyed. Are you annoyed, <laughs> Jimmy? Yeah, because Jimmy I was, gets very annoyed. Yeah, because Jimmy I'm not, I'm not, a, I'm not too. asking a jerk question, and I'm not being a yeah, dick. Yeah. I watched the show. I liked the show more than I thought I would like it. I thought it was ballsy the way they started off. Mm -hmm. But it's a legit question. It's yeah, not, yeah. it's not a hey, what about? I'm not trying to get a, a, a sound bite. I mean, it's a real question, and the show is a reality show. Yeah. So kind of asking about your reality, I think, is fair game. It's not asking in some tabloid way. <laughs> I just want to talk about that. Oh, let's talk about the show. That's why I'm here. What uh, well, what uh, what other other um hijinks uh you get into in the show? <laughs> <laughs> you know, every episode, you never know what's gonna happen. My life is very unpredictable. Your assistant writes porn, mm. and there's a conflict about that. I don't know if I'm allowed to go there, uh, but it's in the show, so I figured I'd ask about it. Um, did she did she stay away from writing it? Because I know that she had to make a decision. So what did she finally do? You have to stay tuned and watch the show and find out. <laughs> I wasn't, I wasn't happy Fair enough. All right. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I lost. <laughs> wow. Oh, uh, you're a tough one, Paris. You're a little tough. Yeah, we have a lot of people in and out of here, and uh, uh, some are easy, some a little tough. You threw us a little with that, um, the, the little spin around and the want to talk about the show thing. But the show, if the show's about your life. You know, we were just kind of leading up to getting to know you a little more about your life and stuff. So, Huge. I think you kind of, I think you kind of took that in a well, weird I, way. I think a lot of people followed her lead. I mean, you've moved on to other things, but you know, the partying and the the oopsie shots coming in, going in. Yeah, you kind of, you kind of were, you know, at the forefront of that whole thing that was going you on. You introduced the world to Kim Kardashian. Where are you at with her? We're great. We're fine. You guys are still friends and all? Yeah, I wish her the best. <laughs> she wishes everyone the best. Uh, no, no, I'm no. happy for her. That's great. But you don't She's hang out? She's married and I'm really happy for her. You don't hang out anymore with her though? I'm so busy. I'm traveling the world all the time, so I don't really have time to hang out with them. Jimmy? I'll check it out next time. I'm trying to think of something from the show. Um, <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> there is a scene where she's driving a pink Rolls Royce, I think, which is a nice car. Is that yours? It's a Bentley. Is it a Bentley? Yeah, thank you, yes. Uh, what's it like to just be so completely rich? I've worked for everything that I've achieved on my Stop. Own. So Stop. Stop. I feel very blessed. You, you, I thank God every day. Re you, now, worked in what way? Um, well, I run 17 different product lines. I have created my, whole, well, now. my entire business out of it. Now. I've been working since I'm 15 years old. So yeah? What was your first job? A model. A model. Yes. Okay. Well, that makes sense. I, I would never... I'm not going to diss models. <laughs> Did you have a preconceived notion? Because a lot of people come in here and they think that we're going to be a certain way. Or they think that we're going to be aggressive with them. Or they think that we're going to try to do something awful. So they kind of come in defensive because they're expecting something that we're not going <laughs> to... Honestly. Yeah. I've I, seen that before. I've seen it happen. And I've walked into radio stations or whatever where I think that they're going to be a certain way and it's okay. Did you have a preconceived notion about us? Honestly. No. No. She doesn't, she doesn't even know us. She's just on <laughs> the radio Now that she's tour. being very defensive about, about like, like, I could see the way you're sitting, like you're on guard and you don't need to be. Like, I don't know what... We're not trying to screw you over. We're trying to help oh. you promote the show. But it's a reality show and we're asking you about life and you're getting like a little... Right, the world according uh, to Paris. Yeah. Yes. It's on uh, Wednesdays at 10 on the Oxygen. Huge. So we thought we could talk about the world. Yeah. We are. <laughs> yeah. That world according that you to live you. In, which is very different than the average person. That's why it makes for a good show. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Exactly. Mm -hmm. what, uh, there is a good fight scene in the first one. The yeah. camera in the car. I won't give it away. You have to stay tuned. <laughs> there is a good argument, which I did enjoy watching. Um, yeah. <laughs> Jimmy's really annoyed. Yeah, I am, but uh, whatever. I mean, I did enjoy the show. I'm not going to tell you I didn't like the show. I didn't expect to like the show, but I did. And it's not, I'm not your target demo. Well, thank you. Thank you very much for uh, stopping by. What, what Jimmy? No, I just was going to wonder if it was... Because for people to watch a reality show, they want to know that they're seeing your life for real as it is. Yes. You cannot write the things that happen. It's nuts. I yeah. love it. <laughs> I don't know if we sold the show tonight. No. We didn't sell it at all. We did. Our listeners don't like her. What? Yeah, they don't really like you for some reason. I, I, spoke, I spoke highly about well, the show, probably... and I, I, but I wasn't bullshitting when I spoke highly about the show. I really wasn't. I mean, I, if I didn't like it, believe me, right now I would tell you, but I did Oh, like yeah, it. yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, well, yeah, they're all getting up to... Uh, yeah. Yeah, Roland's uh, standing at the window, um, just peering <laughs> up. But, but uh, Paris, thank you very much thank you. for uh, stopping in, and uh, good luck with the show. Thank you, guys. Take care. Have a fun Bye. morning. We're not going to get off the air. We're just going to keep <laughs> talking. So yeah. feel free to remove your headphones and, Huge. you know, whatever. We even took a photo you together guys. a while ago. I was going to ask did? you to sign it, but I don't want to bother you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mind. Are you sure? Because, I, I mean, I, I hate to be more of a bother than I've been already, wow. obviously. Oh, oh, thanks. This is a good shot of us, too. Look, look at that look, picture, look right? Look at how unshaven I am. I have gray hair. Oh, oh thanks. That's a nice picture, right? Roland, where did it go wrong? Hmm? Roland? Where did it go wrong, you think? Where did it go wrong? <laughs> uh, Jimmy's, um, Jimmy's almost swallowing his teeth. I mean, it's very I'm not that bad. fun to, Thank um, you, to watch. Thank you. Thank you, Paris. Bye, guys. There, there she goes. All right. Paris Hilton. Out Have the door. Day. Remember to say goodbye to Roland. He's a very nice Thank gentleman. You're welcome. Take Bye, it guys. easy. Right. You forgot your phone. Oh, Damn. No, I wasn't gonna say anything. Oh. That, no. Wow. <laughs> that could have been huge. Huge. Could have gotten some pictures. Bye guys. Bye. <laughs> bye bye. I got the quote direct from her mouth. What? She said, and I quote, I am not gonna sit and waste my time being berated. End quote. When just now? Yes, walking out. But we didn't berate her. About what? I don't know. Her one of the ladies in her entourage was making excuses out there that she probably doesn't feel like playing because she's tired. We weren't playing. Playing? We, we weren't playing. We were doing it. It's, it's a reality called, show. Called, wait, it's called an interview. I know. When she comes in here, I understand they want to plug the show, but we can't just sit here for 10, 15 minutes saying the name of the show, the time it's on, and who's in it. We have to get, like, the people kind of... You know, involved and, and, and listening to her story and maybe something that, that what a hasn't been heard. What a spoiled human being. And I'm going to tell you, I, I bit my tongue. Oh, I know the you. The better did. of the show. Yes, and for you, Roland, and by the way, we fucking. If we hear were nice one word for you. of shit from a publicist about that. We, I have never. We oh were not rude God. to her. I have um, no, no, nobody said anything. I have no, oh, you, never. You'll hear something. No, 